In 2003, when we joined New Life, we was not tithing at all. We wasn't tithing because we wasn't taught how to tithe. This went on until we completed the financial class. In the class, it was said, if you want to know where your money is, where your love is, look at your checkbook. I was not happy because then I knew my family was in financial trouble. So that's when I began to follow instructions that was taught by spiritual parents. I began to obey, and most importantly, I began to trust in God and believe in His Word. So fast forward, 2010, we were tithing, giving our first fruits, being obedient, but something was missing. So we attended the Financial Peace course. So immediately, once I got the word that I needed to refinance my home, we followed those instructions. So the refinance went according to plan. And we had a meeting in our home in which I spoke a word to my family and I told my youngest daughter that once she graduates from college, she will purchase Demetrius and Sharita home. Demetrius and Sharita will purchase our current home and Anita and I will build our dream home. I didn't expect for the plans to happen so fast as far as us finding a dream home, as far as us having to put the down payment down and, and move so quickly because we would have lost a lot. But now, here we are, trusting in God, having faith, and Jasmine and everyone is in place to receive the blessing. Jasmine moved into Sharita's home. Sharita and Demetrius moved into their our home, and we moved into our dream. God is going to work it all out. You must trust Him with your tithes and your first fruits. And I would like to thank Bishop and Lady Dudley for holding us accountable and teaching us a good word. Because if He did it before, he would do it again. Same God right now, same, same God, God back then. then.